in this video guide, I want to share with you the cool feature called Deposit Hold. So this option is uh, uh, implemented only on the Stripe uh, payment system right now because uh, the rest of the payment system doesn't have this feature. So pay attention for it. If you're using the Stripe, you can easily uh, work with the holding of some amounts of the customer payment card automatically. Uh, let me show you how it works. So basically, you will need to successfully integrate with the Stripe. Right. When you will do this, uh, you can go for the reservation and work with the deposit halt option. Go inside action edit. Uh, the next find the payment section and uh, from other options like you already know that is uh, deposit payment discount. You will be have uh, you will have deposit hold uh, additional option. So choose it. Choose payment date and method should be uh, chosen as a card. And next, you can put any amount that you want to use and hold it from the customer card. Uh, basically, you can use any amount, but we recommend it to using for deposits uh, only or uh, together with like deposit plus damage access if you have it. So, for instance, we will make it this option of 400 for this amount and this amount. And you can see three bottoms. You can see status is not paid as default. Uh, and uh, when you press the hold, the system immediately send it the request for customer email. Basically, it looks like very similar where you're sending the payment link, uh, but the text of uh, of the email will be like uh, such amount will be holded from your account. So please confirm. And customer click the bottom pay. Uh, when he will pay it, it's not uh, going as a payment for your balance, it's holded. So it means that you will find the status is hold. Uh, and it means that uh, you will have the three sides. So side number one, this is the customer card balance, which is uh, he sent this money to to your account, but it's stuck on the middle. It's holded, right? So it's like this money is on hold on the customer balance, but not yet uh, receiving from your side as well. So it's like on the middle between your account balance and customer account balance. And when the rental will be over, uh, basically uh, you will have two options, refund and capture. Uh, when you press refund, the system will immediately return all this uh, amount together, like 400 all, right? Uh, the capture means that uh, capture on your side. So it means, for instance, you want to receive some money. If you want to receive full amount, you just press 400. If you want to receive partly, for instance, 100, so you press 100, it means that you refund 300 and 100 you receiving for your account, right? So as a uh, deposit. Uh, pay attention also that this feature it inside Stripe working only for one week maximum. So if you have uh, this limitation is going only from the Stripe side, not ours. So uh, if you have, for instance, two weeks rental order, uh, the system or you will be needed to manually send it this uh, request every month, every week. Sorry. So pay attention also for it. Uh, this is how it looks and works. This feature uh, for sure for for, for short-term rentals and. Uh, orders this feature is really cool because you can hold it uh, any amount and this is really convenient to use uh, hope you like this video uh, if you find it useful for yourself so press like button and thanks for watching see you on the next video guys